We've literally just got in the car. Oh no. And I've kicked it, kicked the uh, perfect bit of force. Ah. So here we go. I vlogged, the camera hasn't been turned on in a couple of days, but I decided that I was going to vlog today. Just going to be heading down to Watford Audi, um, see the guys down there. They haven't actually seen the wrap of the car, so. Oh, the heat's on. Oh, and the heated seat. Um, so I'm looking forward to heading down to Watford Audi. Um, going to try and sort out a part for the engine light as well, if you remember from uh, a video a long time ago, trying to work out what the problem was with my uh, car. I still haven't fixed it. That is what we're going to be doing today. I've been driving my car over the last two, uh, two to three days and the, the um, F1 tone has completely stopped. There is no F1 tone anymore in the Army Trix exhaust, which I'm sad about because it was better sounding than the muscle tone. Um, into first and away we go. Dodge all of the uh, Maserati to the right of me and the Ferrari to the left. And as I pull out here, there's a Ferrari in front of me as well. Right. We're off. So, first things first, how are we all doing? Um, I can't remember the last vlog that I did, but on the Saturday I uploaded Living With A Supercar, and then you also saw my car pathetically lose to the new uh, 2014 Army Trix Porsche owned by Tom, which, um, yeah, I was really embarrassed about, but his car's stupidly loud anyway. Damn it. The mat isn't working properly, it's not on properly. But I'm just going to be using this vlog to catch up with you all, keep you up to date with what's going on behind the scenes at Supercars of London, driving down to Watford Audi um, so that the uh, guys that I know down there can check out the new wrap. We're only a couple of minutes away from Watford Audi. On the way back, I'm gonna be talking to you about what to expect from the Supercars of London YouTube channel coming uh, the end of this year and also what's going to be happening um, in 2015 as well. So whilst I wait at these traffic lights and everyone stares at me, um, I want to, I don't even know what I'm gonna say. I'm just gonna go. from everyone looking. I lose concentration because I know that people are looking at me and it makes it awkward for everyone. Oh, and now I'm stuck another red light. So yes, down to Watford Audi, going to be doing some research on a few parts, getting um, the reaction of some of the workers down there and what they think of the Audi R8 in baby blue. They saw it in the red and gold Iron Man and uh, thoroughly enjoyed it. So, um, yeah, the sun's out. Whoa. The sun's really out, Jesus. And the annoying thing with this car, actually it did work. The sun visors are that big that big. You'd think that they won't do anything for the sun. Disable bay. So, ladies and gentlemen, that is the problem, or that is what happens when you haven't made an appointment and you come down to Watford Audi on a whim, um, trying to catch up with uh, a friend of yours who's a salesman and they've got a customer. Being told to come back in an hour. So. Back to work. <laughs> mm. So driving home from Wofford Audi, 
um, after being told to come back in an hour. Um, let's talk about living with a supercar this Saturday's episode. I know we're on Wednesday, um, but I think it's the ideal opportunity to do so as um, tomorrow's throwback Thursday. Not sure what to do for a video on Friday. I might be out all day filming, which would mean that a video won't be going live on the Friday evening. So then it leads on to Saturday at midday. The video that I'm going to be doing is talking about the fuel economy and what it's like to live with a car uh, that's got such a, a guzzling fuel economy. Now, uh, I did a episode driving up to Edinburgh on one tank of fuel, which I did perfectly. However, I think the fuel economy of this car has gone down quite considerably since the exhaust has uh, warmed up and realised that um, I don't drive it too conservatively. Um, so I wanted to do a video talking about the different uh, fuel economies, different driving styles that you can have in this car with the valves on, with the valves off, with my exhaust system. And I drive from one side of the M25 to the other. And it's quite funny, I drive across the Dartford Tunnel which is um, quite enjoyable, then get in the wrong lane. Um, Jesus the sun. Get in the wrong lane, realise that I haven't got any cash and I need to pay by card, or the other way around, I'm not quite sure. The video is not edited yet. Um, however, it is quite a good episode. I'm looking forward to editing it up and making it into a good, fun-filled um, episode. Talking about something that's actually relatively quite boring, talking about the fuel economy of a car and such. But with a car like this, it's a bit more interesting. Um, and the different uh, ways in which you can drive this car, stop. Take two on our trip. Torford Audi, slightly darker, half past three. And it's time to go. The music's gonna turn on. I'm just gonna turn it off. And off we go. What have I done to pass the time in the last hour? Difficult to put my finger on. Whilst I'm driving down to Watford Audi, I'm quickly going to talk to you about some of the video plans that I've had, uh, what I've been doing over the last couple of days, brainstorming some ideas and things like that. I'm away from the 27th of December as I'm going to France, and um, as cool as France is, where I'm going has absolutely zero signal. It's completely out in the countryside, so um, I'm gonna be cut off from the YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram world, um, which, to my family will be um, an enjoyable break but to me when all of these videos will be going live it's going to be quite difficult um, but I've uh, begun arranging the Christmas special videos I'm going to be editing a couple of cool videos uh, the best of 2014 the supercar sounds uh, with a few more surprises there's gonna be a couple of supercars of London Christmas specials um, we're approaching 100,000 subscribers uh, which I'm really excited about hitting and I am currently in the works um, for creating a really really special video to uh, thank you all for subscribing and supporting me um, and also hopefully going to be putting on a really really cool Supercars of London show for you. Oh the sun's bright in my eyes. Really bright. Now it's really dark and I'm going to try and set you up. Right, here, go. Quite blurry. But just finished up at Watford Audi. Um, we think that we've identified the part that is needed that is going to fix the car. Um, we've also um, had quite a bit of fun down there and um, maybe got a little plan together. So um, valves off, even though it's still loud. And um, quickly back to my laptop to upload this vlog. I hopefully um, the information has come across in the way that I want it to come across um, and that you've enjoyed this update. Um, I look forward to seeing you tomorrow for Throwback Thursday. I'm not sure what video I'm going to be doing. Friday, I hope to see Aspect Valeting who are gonna be detailing and ceramic coating my car, uh, which I still actually need to organize. Um, but that's it for today. Um, and I will see you tomorrow for another Supercars of London video. I don't know why I haven't said bye. See you later, guys.